What is going on guys? Sid here with another installment of Spooky Season Specials, Spooky Warm-Ups. And guys, today on the menu we have Bones of Halloween. Guys, um, I, I don't know what to tell you about this game. You know, this is like the dude where's my car, um, of video games. Like, that, like that's, that's, that's kind of like where my head is right now. So there's different modes in this game. We're gonna jump into like the classic mode, right? So what do I mean when I say it's like the dude where's my car of games? Well guys, it's like minimal. It, like, if you jump into this game, you're going in, uh, with one, for one reason and one reason alone. It's just to shoot up a bunch of like... Uh, skeleton jack-o-lanterns. That's it. That's that's literally it, right? And right there, I got off to like a, a stupid false start, and I just restarted it really quickly, trying to get the hang of the game, right? Um, obviously, I'm recording this in post-processing, right? But guys, here's my runs, right? I, I did a couple runs, and uh, I don't want to spoil anything, right? But I, I did like try to like best my high score, right? The game's pretty much it's so freaking simple. It's laid back. It's chill, guys. I had a huge weekend, um, a huge Friday night, right? Just just kind of like, uh, I'm kind of like really tired, right? Um, so um, kind of really just want to like like chill. Like I I I got a huge headache now, and um, I kind of just want to just kick back and just. Enjoy some, like some some like spooky festivities, right? It's nearly halfway to Halloween, guys. If you guys are Halloween buffs or horror buffs, you guys already know this. So, um, the horror community always knows this, right? So, uh, so in any case, right? Um, we're, yeah, we're in Bones of Halloween, simplest concept of a game ever, right? It's first person shooter, survival, right? Um, that's, uh, and you just have to, you have to just best your score, right? That's that's literally it. You don't want to use any brain power, no brain power whatsoever, right? You're just shooting a bunch of jack o' lanterns on the screen. I paid like five bucks, like, like it was like under five bucks for this game, right? So I was just like, right, you know what? Why not? Why not? Why not give it a go? Let's see what the game's all about, right? And that was like the mindset. I forgot how much I actually paid for it, right? But I just bought it off the first team at work, and uh, yeah, check this jack o' lantern out, right? He's got lasers. Um, coming out of his eyes, right? And you get fortune cards, right? So this is my first time actually going like these these runs that you're seeing. Uh, it's like literally just my first time actually, um, you know, like uh, taking my time and uh, playing the classic mode, right? Because I actually ended up like going into like the different modes that they offered sooner, right? Uh, like like the non-traditional modes, right? Just to see what the game was all about, right? And um, this was the actual mode, right? The classic mode. And I had like skipped over it, but now I understand it a little better, right? So, the concept is simple and straightforward, right? Game over, enemies killed 19, right? So, right right around here, I'm just like getting like the premise of the game, trying to like figure out a set strategy, how to go about, you know, where to shoot. Obviously, you want to shoot the head, right? Um, And this game, I'm, what I'm going to tell you is like, uh, the enemies come, like, they're, they're really random on the screen, right? And that's the types of enemies are really random, right? And the fortune cards really just like are the toss-up in the game, right? Um, so sometimes it's gonna be like, uh, so every time you like uh, one of the fortune cards comes up on the screen, it kind of gives you a little boost of health, right? So you get a little bit of a health boost back, right? That's the first thing with the fortune cards. The second thing with the fortune cards, sometimes they'll make the enemy bigger by like 15%. The fog will be like, um, like either more dense or less dense, right? Uh, it, it, it's pretty much a grab bag, right? Um, so the game does change, right? Um, uh, from when you start to when you are in the game, but it's like subtle changes, like small changes, right? Nothing huge, nothing intense, right? You're literally just going in there to just chill. Like this game is just all about chilling out. It's, it's not about like hyper competitive play that you often uh, see in like literally any other multiplayer game right? this is pretty much just single player um chill mode right so you're just chilling you're kicking back and that's exactly what we're doing right now we are kicking back and we are taking a break from fifa 23 we're taking a break from all types of competitive games right um i actually wanted to like um jump into some, like some like harder games today but then the minute like like my headache is just like oh my god like i've, I've got like a massive migraine right now and I'm like super tired, and this is like the perfect game, right? I, 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 I didn't want to do anything serious, but I did want to bring you guys content, right? So, uh, right here, um, sniper rifle, right? 
Um, but I don't think I had enough coinage for the sniper rifle. I had 11.5 actually, right? Um, so I think I actually do. Hmm. Uh, I think the enemies were coming at me too hard, right? So there you can see like right there one of the fortune cards uh, changed the fog, uh, the density of the fog. And um, yeah, it's pretty much a grab on, right? So every time I went for this weapon, bam, I just kept getting bashed over the head, right? Uh, I gotta cough real quick. Yeah, I had to lower the mic for that, but so so I'm averaging like 18 kills, right? You guys are seeing this, right? 18 kills, right? So in this mode, like I'm just tr I'm just like now getting the hang of the mode, and that's why I was like I was struggling at first, and then in my head I'm like, okay, you know what? Let's start piecing together a strategy how to take these guys out, right? Where to go, how to move, right? Things like that. And here's the next run in Bones of Halloween. I'm gonna let you enjoy some of the gameplay, right? Uh, and not take away my talking. Guys, guys, you gotta check this run out. So there you have it, guys, 34 enemies killed and we're nine minutes and 42 seconds into the video. And uh, guys, I said to myself, hmm, 34 enemies. 
can I do one better now that I've got the hang of the mechanics now that I've got the hang of just oh, taking out these these crazy these crazy little jackal engines right so like I said like like I'm telling you it's a chill game it's a chill mode right but you do have to use some some energy right in terms of like you gotta use some of your brain power right uh because there is a strategy to taking these guys out when to take them out when to engage how to engage right and uh which weapons to pick up right and uh accumulating the coinage right uh so um this is gonna be the fun i believe this is gonna be the final go in uh in this video right in today's run right i definitely want to play this again it's definitely one of the games that i'm gonna play um over the course of the year when i don't want to think about anything like i just want to like clear my head and just like chill like and not play anything competitive based right because i think it's like too many years of like competitive gaming competitive 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 and even though when i play fifa 23 it's more for like the rtg sake there's still too much competitiveness right that that can just like wear you down like mentally right over the course of the year right so that's definitely one of those things it was the same thing when i was in modern warfare it was the same thing when i was back in like quake like like i for for, for the people that have been following this channel for a long time right i'm a quake 2 boy i'm one of the old one of the old gamers right one of the ogs right um I'm, i was there i was there in those in, in those multiplayer uh days right and uh that's when i was bigger on first person shooters right and uh really the infancy of of 3d 3d gaming right and uh i was there i was there i was there right 3d competitive gaming right i was there guys and uh yeah after a while <clears throat> after a while it really does wear on you right your eyes right your your reflexes go and uh you kind of like have other things that that creep up on you in life right so um I mean, do I want to play competitively for the rest of my life? I don't think so, right? I want to kick back. I want to chill. I want to vibe. I want to try different games. I want to check out what the developers are really, you know, just like like dishing out. And even though the graphics in this game, right, are, are aren't the best, they're they're definitely not up to scratch, right? I'm gonna tell you right now, like it's it's still a really fun experience, right? Um, especially if you go in with zero expectations, right? zero you gotta have no expectations when you play games like these you um you you just want to like get the experience right the novelty right because if you're always like thinking of a game uh in comparison to another game right you kind of it kind of takes away it, it oftentimes it takes away from the uniqueness of what the developers are trying to do right and sometimes it's a hit or miss right more often times than not it's a miss right for um one of the bigger studios Right? Um, it, uh, well, no, they, they, they know what they're doing, but for the smaller studios, right? It's, it's like, it's like, where am I going with this? What I mean to say is, like, it's like, uh, there's like a game, uh, like, uh, there's a development cycle, right? And for the larger studios, right? Um, the, the, the if they wanted to start working on another game, right? Uh, for a console, it would take like you know like it, it, it takes years it takes years right so when you have a game like this right which is just like pretty much a plug and play type experience where you you don't really have to think uh, and it's not from a larger studio right um it doesn't have a bigger budget anything like that right um what you're what what, what you're really seeing right is you know just somebody's like attempt at doing something unique right really niche right and uh hoping that it pays off right in a in a bigger way right and 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 it may not for the smaller studios right because they don't have the staff they don't have that that creative power right um so it's always cool to like highlight these games right like um the smaller uh, the smaller studios it's always cool to highlight them but where was i going with this uh i'm trying to i'm trying to be nice right because there's 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 like a lot of people that would like bash the game unnecessarily without trying it, right? Or just like getting the concept of it, right? And um, they'd be like, why are you wasting your time in this, right? Well, it has its purpose, right? For me at least, it has its purpose, right? I said I needed a game to kick back and chill, not really take any uh, take take too seriously, right? Because like FIFA 23, like year round, 
every year-round thing, right? Uh, every season of a FIFA game cycle. It was the same thing in Call of Duty. It was the same thing in Quake. It was the same thing in, like like Quake Two. It was the same thing in like Unreal. It was the same same thing everywhere, right? It's just like competition, 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 competition. And even now, like I'm just like trying to sit sit back and and chill, right? And just shoot some some jack o' lanterns, right? Some jack o' lantern skeletons, right? Or whatever the hell you want to call them, right? And even now, I'm like trying to like compete with my best scores, right? So it's always like this, like, like you, you never really get to like enjoy the experience because you're always, you know, like you're always trying to best yourself and best yourself. Well, that's where this video ended up going, right? I didn't mean for it to happen that way, but I just was like, okay, you know what? It's a fun little mini game experience. Let's let, let let's let's see if I can best my my kill count, right? Um, for how many jackal engines I could kill. Right, and that's how this video ended up being made, right? Uh, a couple minutes ago, right? But yeah, it's literally it's for the funds, right? It's for the LOLs, right? And if you guys happen to pick up the game, right? If you guys happen to pick up the game, I'm telling you right now, uh, you gotta go in with zero expectations, and you gotta go in with the context that you're 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 base. It's just a shoot 'em up, right? You, you're not really looking to get like a plot, a narrative. You're not really getting anything. You're just shooting up freaking freaking jack-o-lanterns that's it that's it that's it right you're gonna get a cool little fortune card and you're gonna chill right you're gonna chill this is not an advertisement right i'm just, i'm literally just jumping into the game i like the game right especially today where i have a huge headache i'm hung over like crazy right and i just want to like relax right and let that's what i mean when i say it's like a dude it's like the dude where's my car of spooky games right so yeah um i'm still going right this 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 is like the longest run you're ever gonna see and i hope you guys are gonna enjoy it right guys so likes comments subscription notification bell they all help keep the channel going right we need this channel to be thriving so do hit that subscribe button don't worry i'm gonna bring you more fifa 23 content but that game's kind of a that game right now it's kind of annoying me right i'm getting like next to nothing in terms of like players right and it's like a large a large amount of grinding insurmountable amounts of grinding because it's like a pure rtg where i put in no money right and when the gambles pay off they pay off big they oftentimes pay up big when the gambles don't pay off ugh, you want to scream right so in any case right i'm down to three guys so do hit that like button sub if you are new happy halfway to halloween guys peace love all the blessings to you and yours sid 77 enemies killed can you guys do better i hope you guys can right because i want to i want to try this game again and hopefully i get a better score peace